Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and you are watching Medicos Hub. In this video, we are going to discuss the various types of T cells. First one is helper T cells. These are also known as CD4 cell or T4 cells. These cells are activated by the peptide antigens presented over the surface of APCs along with MHC class 2 that is major histocompatibility class 2 molecules. Now these helper T cells are of two types. Type 1 helper T cells which are designated as TH1 then TH2 that is type 2 helper T cells stimulated by the type 1 helper T cells are stimulated by interleukin 12 while type 2 are stimulated by interleukin 2 then secrete when activated these secrete interleukin 2 which stimulates the type 2 helper cell while these secrete interleukin 3, 4, 6, 9, 10 and 13. Now what are the various effector cells on which these interleukins work? Here these stimulate the macrophages and the cytotoxic T cells. Here these stimulate the monocytes, B cells, eosinophils and also the mast cells. Now what is the function The main function is to stimulate cell mediated immunity to activate the efficacy of killing by macrophages to promote the activity of cytotoxic T cells and also it promotes the immunoglobulin production. While here the function is to stimulate cell humoral immunity it is stimulating the B cells that's why it promotes the humoral immunity then also Ig production so immunoglobulin production is mainly enhanced by the type 2 helper T cell 
so this is the first type of T cell second is T suppressor cells their main function is to inhibit the cell mediated immunity and these also inhibit the auto reactive T cells that have escaped the negative selection in thymus gland. These two types of cells that is helper T cells and suppressor T cells are collectively termed as regulatory T cells. Another is effector cells. So T cells, types of T cells which are termed as effector T cells are T cytotoxic cells. These are also known as killer T cells. So these are third type of T cells, also known as CD8 cells. Now what is the main function? These kill or lyse the cells after identifying them or identifying the surface receptors. For example, virus or virally affected cells or the tumor cells. This identification is done by attachment of cytotoxic T cell with the antigens presented on all nucleated cells of our body which are associated with MHC1 molecules. Another role of cytotoxic T cell is in organ transplant rejection. Second type of effector cell is DTH cell. These DTH cells are delayed type hypersensitivity cells. So what is the function of these cells? These cells secrete lymphokines like interferon gamma that mediate delayed type hypersensitivity reactions. These cells cannot be differentiated from type 1 helper cells on the basis of surface antigens. Next one is MLR cells. These are mixed lymphocytic reaction cells. These cells undergo rapid proliferation during mixed lymphocytic reactions. These helper T cells, suppressor T cells are collectively termed as regulatory T cells. These are effector T cells 
which include cytotoxic T cell, DTH cell and MLR cells. Now we will discuss some other types of T cells that is natural killer T cells, that is memory cells and the gamma delta type of T cells. These are memory T cells. Memory T cells are subsets of cytotoxic T cells and helper T cells that are treated with antigens. These remain in body for long time when infection is treated. Another type is NK T cells, natural killer T cells. These are not natural killer cells. These are natural killer T cells. These have properties of both natural killer cell and T cell. These are not MHC restricted. Now, what is the mechanism of action of these cells? These are stimulated by glycolipid antigens. It is important because conventional T cells are stimulated by peptide antigens. When stimulated, these secrete cytolytic substances and cytokines. The release of cytolytic substances is the action of NK cells while the secretion of cytokines is the action of T cells. So because it is releasing both cytolytic substance as well as cytokines it is termed as NK T cells and these secretions will result in destruction of tumor cells and virally infected cells like herpes. So these are NK T cells. Now the next one is gamma delta T cells. These form 2% of the total T cells and found in gut mucosa. We know that all the T cells are having T cell receptors made up of one alpha and one beta chain. But these are having the T cell receptors made up of one gamma chain plus one delta chain. These are also not MSC restricted. Now, we are discussing the type of cells and their specific surface receptors or markers. Pan T marker that is on all T cells CD2 and CD3 are found on all T cells. Helper T cells and DTS cells have the surface markers of CD4. Cytotoxic T cells and suppressor T cells have CD8 as surface markers and the CD19 is the surface marker for B cells. So these are the various types of T cells. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.